lawmaker called for the arrest of uh, Rocha Sokorocha and really he's in a very big trouble and like that is not all the hotel of his wife have also been sealed by Hope Uzadema. Anyway, interesting stuff's coming your way shortly, but please guys ensure that you have subscribed to this channel and also give this video a thumbs up and also don't forget to hit the notification bell so you get updated anytime we drop a new video. Yes, guys, this is the best place to be and don't forget this is Saffron Media and we're here to give you the most trending, exciting, reliable and authentic happenings in Nigeria. And more especially in the area of politics okay guys without wasting much time let us get right into the details and see what is going on with Rocha Sokorocha and Hope Uzadema of Imo State why he is uh, about to be arrested and also the hotel of the wife have also been sealed off by who find out right here all right guys it says right here that uh, calls on Uzadema to recover every looted Imo property from Okorocha. The Imo State House of Assembly member representing Oweri West, Mr. Kanayo Onyemiachi, has called on the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, to seriously put former Governor Rojas Okorocha's 80th tenure rule under their microscope. Oyemeachi made the call while reacting to Okorocha's claim that he was the owner of Eastern Palm University, which was allegedly built with Imo state funds. Oyemeachi stated that in Western countries, the likes of Rocha Okorocha would have been cooling off in prison for leadership rascality. Oyemeachi expressed shock at how Okorocha would brazenly lay claims to a university built with funds from the state treasury and further stated that Okorocha committed many leadership blunder while in office that should warrant his arrest and imprisonment. The Yemachi labored Okorocha's eight years reign as Imo governor as disastrous, wasteful and fraudulent. The Yemachi insisted that Okorocha would be investigated and brought to public scrutiny Oyemechi called on Senator Hope Uzadima to look into the other property of the Imo state government allegedly, illeg al allegedly illegally taken over by Okorocha, listing the Rochas College of Africa, Oji, Okorocha's Pibat estate, amongst others. Oyemechi thanked Uzadima for recovering EPU to Imo state, stating that Imo was the rightful owner of institution in another turn of event the emo state house of assembly approved the motion to change the name of the institution from instant palm university to ko mbadiwe university well as it is also hope Zadima has sealed off the uh, hotel of orochas or korocha's wife and really uh, that detail is really, really uh, uh, shocking and surprising. The Hopus Adema administration are not applying any breaks in his effort to recover every supposedly looted state property from the family of former Governor Rochas Okorocha. A team of government officials and police led by the Commissioner for Lands, Barrister Eyinaya Onuebu, in the evening of 19th of February 2020, stormed the Royal Spring Palm Hotels, an apartment allegedly owned by Nelma Rochas Okorocha, wife of the former governor of Imo State, Rochas Okorocha, and sealed off the property. Recall that the Hope Uzadima administration last week recovered and renamed the Eastern Palm, the Eastern Palm University from Rochas Okorocha. Okorocha is currently battling Uzadema over the recovery of the university as Uzadema struck again, taking away his wife's hotel on Friday. Also recall that the State House of Assembly representing Oweri West have called on Hope Uzadema to arrest and imprison Rocha Okorocha as well as recover property allegedly looted by Okorocha, such as his Seabat Estate, Rocha's International Schools, 
The latest recovery of the hotel of the former governor's wife seemed to signal Uzanima's determination to recover every state property alleged, allegedly stolen by the former first family. There were reports of sporadic shooting during the operation, as shown in the attached uh, report with unconfirmed reports of injury. So on that very report, there was no uh, injured person, but thank God that, uh, of course, that uh, there was no death recorded or injury recorded. But all the same, uh, right now that uh, Rocha Sokorocha has uh, is now about to face the the law well i cannot really say if he's about to face the law right now because uh, the way nigerians do their thing they do it more of man hunting or witch hunting uh, people than trying to you know make the society better because for the interest of the people and for the interest of the land to become better it is not really about fighting uh rocha sokorocha it's about probing him Yes, it's about probing him, but uh, really, people are not uh, really probed in Nigeria. Rather, they are witch hunted. Because if I'm not of the same party with you, then once you're out of government, I'm just after you. And I want to bring you down just to let you know that I am now more powerful than you are. But really, as uh, Uzo Demai is his hands also clean because he should not also forget that he just has a few years away for him to also leave that seat. But Rocha Sokorocha did a lot of terrible things. In fact, most of them in the APC in some of the southeastern states are just uh, uh, an apology to Nigeria because to Nigerians because really they did not go there to even uh, for the interest of the people. They went for their own interest and for their own pockets. And obviously, that was what they did. Imagine the mighty hotel owned by the wife of the former governor of Imo State, Rocha Sokorocha. And now the present administration have sealed that hotel up and have closed it down. And some other things that Rocha's had to, you know, turn a university to his private property. Those are things that were done with government funds and should be used as government uh, 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 facilities, but rather, he made it a personal thing that once they are leaving office, they change it to their personal property and nothing goes to the state. It is poor. It is bad of any government to continue like this. These are some of the anomalies that should be corrected in the government of today. But anyway, guys, you've heard it all. What do you have to tell us about all of this or what do you have to say? Please drop it in the comment section and also give this video a thumbs up. Do have a pleasant time. Bye for now.